Hi everyone and welcome to another episode of Hereford FC here on Vanilla FM and today we're going to take a look at another match for the Skybet League 2. Uh, the, the progress has been slow in the save um, now at this point in the save because obviously I've not been able to record as many episodes so uh, you will will have noticed that I haven't made much progress since the last episode. It's only the end of September right now. As far as the league goes we are sort of sitting on the bottom half uh, 17th at the moment um, but it's not been going too badly uh, if we compare to let's see uh, if I go back and compare to uh, previous seasons so if we go to stages last season we were finished 17th um, but we well, how do I see the history da -da -da. Yeah, I, I, I can't remember how to see that graph that shows how we've progressed. Um, but yeah, so so it's not too bad. It's not too bad at the moment. Now, let's have a look at the squad for this um, this match. Uh, we have a couple of... Um, uh, like the last couple of matches, we've had a couple of injured players. Uh, so we've had to rest some. We've, had, we've currently we've got um, Andy uh, Finley on the bench just to cover that left side of the fence because Zordania is out with an injury. He's kind of about to come back, really. But yeah, so we're going to go with... I think these are, for the most part, the usual starting 11. Um, and let's take a look. So uh, we are playing currently with... A balanced mentality, uh, most of the time, sometimes I go positive, just depending on the match, really. Uh, the tactics hasn't changed much in the last few um, seasons, as far as these, uh, the, the kind of the strategy and the mentalities and stuff. Uh, the, the, the tactic itself is, if you've not been watching this series from the beginning, uh, I basically just put a tactic out there as far as like the positioning of the players and I just left it. So I've, that's not been touched since the start of the save. Now, uh, as far as the, 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 the history, uh, I guess, uh, where, where we're going with, with the save. Uh, we've been coming up the leagues with Hereford. Um, usually every couple of seasons. Well, it took us a while to get out of the Van Ramen North. But once we got going, then we, we usually spend a couple of seasons in each league and then get promoted to three, three seasons. We've played one season in the Skybet League 2 so far, I think, as far as I can remember. It's been a, actually a long time since I've been playing consistently. But um, So the plan this season is to do a little bit better than last season. I don't think we can do the playoffs um, yet. The main issue that we have at the moment with the club is that we are kind of outgrowing ourselves financially. So we are playing in a league that needs quite a bit of money now. We need a bit of cash to stay competitive, but we don't have the money to do that. And we also don't have the facilities to attract the sort of players that we need either. So we're a little bit strapped. Uh, we're desperately hoping that... Uh, a new owner that's willing to invest in the club will turn up, but I'm not sure how likely that is to happen in the near future. I'm gonna do a couple subs here now. On the wings. There hasn't been much going on this this match. So we might be able to play a second match, who knows. Ah, oh, they just scored a goal. So we're losing now, that's not great. Oh, right. Let's pick ourselves back up. Uh, one last sub. Um, I think I'm gonna go for... He's anxious, the supper song is anxious, which is unlike him. Who's gonna be doing the best job? Okay, fine. 
yeah, so we're starting to get to a place where, you know, our our team, a couple of years ago, our team was actually quite good for the league that it was on, but now because we've been promoted to uh, League 2, um, we really need better players. We need to invest in better players um, and, and, and that. We don't have the money. I know we have youth. Uh, actually, we should check on our youth. Actually, how how they're doing because they just been promoted to a new league as well. Um, we we will check on them. the The youth itself, we haven't been using many young players, like one or two here and there, um, over the seasons. Uh, but the, it isn't really, as far as as far as I think, it isn't really like a reliable source of players we will get one or two here and there that we've been able to use but it's more like if we can sell them make some money off them that's sort of the main plan at the moment so when this match ends we'll just quickly check on our youth and then we'll move on to the next match okay and let's just check where they're at the moment. So they're second of the third division. So they're playing with Bristol, Shrewsbury, Cheltenham, Newport. Uh, so they're not, they're not doing too bad, actually. They're, they're doing really well. They've got two draws, one loss. Four points behind the leader. Pretty good. And the 23s don't have a competitive league yet. They've been doing fixtures, friendlies. But um, that doesn't mean all that much. Yeah, so we've got some promising players that we could keep an eye out. Usually, come January, I will do some sort of review. Um, and at that point, I will look through the youth and see if there's any players that might be worth bumping up to the senior team. But at this stage, I'm just going to let them carry on. I think the weakest position at the moment is probably goal. Um, a goalkeeper, we really need a goalkeeper. As you can see, our finances aren't great at the moment. So we have a very small amount of transfer budget and wage budget left. Holes offer me an interview. That's not what the save is about. So I'm going to decline that. Um, don't want to do that. Yeah, we could do that. Okay. So let's just rep respond that I didn't have any interest anyway. So that's just what that is. Next up we're going to play Oldham. They are 21st in the league. So a few places below us, but that doesn't mean anything. Uh, it's only October, so things are going to change around a lot. It doesn't it doesn't give us an accurate um, idea of whether they're better or worse. few injuries. I'm trying to keep the training quite busy so they carry on working on own aspects um, of the league of, of, of their attributes where there are some gaps. I've just noticed so this is a news item about the some sort of cup. What's this for? 3D, th I don't know what this is. Division 3 Cup. Oh, okay, so we're going to go ahead. Um, I guess we'll know after once this finishes. Okay, I'm intrigued about that. I, I never saw that competition before in their calendar. Let's have a look at that calendar, actually. So there's a cup. Is there an FA Cup? Oh, yeah, the FA Cup, which they haven't started playing yet. Okay. Let's 
just do some um, some praising and some criticizing of players. I think I misclicked earlier. Um, yeah, so I always find it that it's a good idea to give feedback when these prompts come up. And yeah, so I'm just um, going back to the sort of the schedule for the, the save and the channel. I'm just trying to. So this this episode, I just just usually I don't I don't show you matches from this sort of um, time in in the league. I usually like jump forward to January, February. However, I've been so busy that I've had no time to play and I didn't want to not have an episode this week because I think it's good to kind of just see the process, the progress, I suppose, even if um, if not much time has gone past. Um, and maybe it's actually quite good to maybe get some of the feedback from you as well, from comments and things like that. Um, so if you have any feedback, uh, anything that you would have seen that maybe you would have done differently, then feel free to put it in the comments. But yeah, I really need to um, make some progress with the save. It's been quite hard now with the, you know, all the changes and stuff. Uh, getting quite busy at the moment. Right, I think this team is okay. I've made a couple of changes, but I think I'm going to go ahead. Let me just check the bench. I can put Zornadian back on. Um, so we've got defense. Midfield, left, okay. I'm gonna put this guy in instead. And I think I'm happy with all that. So let's go to the match. Some players are unhappy with the way we're playing, okay. I don't know if that's a recent thing or... So let's look down here now at the table. Wide shot. So down here at the table then, Old Ham, 21st. And I think we're 18th. That kind of went quickly, but I think I saw 18th. Is that a penalty? Oh yeah, come on. Penalty. I was going to take that. Sapper. Yeah, Sapper or Song. And he doesn't miss. Only the third goal of the season, so that's a worry. That kind of gives us a sign that he's not doing as well as in previous seasons. So that bumps us up to 15th, which is pretty good. I could have put the ball in the area, but oh, never mind. I kind of missed a chance there. This guy missed his run. Okay, so a few mistakes. Let's see if we can get the ball back. Defense gets the ball back and lunge to a sapper. Can he score? Made the wrong decision by shooting that side, but okay. At least got a corner. Out to Doyle, puts it back in in the middle, and that's the end of the highlights. Free kick. Not even a corner. Okay. So we're getting a lot, a lot more highlights in this game than in the game against... Um, who, who did we play just now? Somebody. Nottingham, I think. Nottingham are at the top of the league, I think. Uh, third or something like that.
Oh, there was not much we could do about that. It was just a cut that went straight to his feet, so not a lot we could do about that. Let's see that again. So this guy misses his tackle. And then he's free to pass. And then the cut goes straight to his feet and the goalkeeper was already down. So couldn't recover from that. Sap is not fast enough for that. <laughs> I don't know how old the Sapo song is now. He was quite young when he started with us, but he's probably 23, so he's still probably quite young. There we go. Nice goal there, but it's out offside. I think. Yeah, offside. Hmm. Yeah, quite a bit offside. All right, fair enough. McBride could have crossed, to be fair. Could have put it back in, because the goalkeeper came all the way out. Could have put it back into someone on either side, but decided to shoot Do the hardest bit. Free kick. In the corner. Take that. That's a good goal. Nice. Similar arrangement from this side. Oh, yeah, we need to sort out our goalkeeping. You could have closed that post better. Okay. Um, I don't think there's any changes I can do right now. So let's just carry on. Thought that was going to be a wasted pass, but thankfully it wasn't. Brown to Doyle. Doyle's going to shoot. Ah, unlucky. Okay, we gave away a really close free kick here. And now we are losing. Ugh. That was a... That was a nice goal actually from them. But again, in the post, he could have closed that a lot better. So I think we're not gonna play that goalkeeper cool again. Learn my lesson. I put him in this game just to see and um, I think I'll learn my lesson here. I'll stick with Kami. Oh, unlucky, okay. We still carry on? Okay, we're carrying on. The highlight is over.
I'm gonna do some subs shortly. I wish I had a goalkeeper on the bench. This is one match that I really wish I had a goalkeeper on the bench. Now, let's put uh, just combe in. Um, Solomana, a captain. And these guys are losing their stamina, so let's put McManus in. Okay, fresh defense, fresh midfield, fresh attack. Oh, well, someone fresh in attack, someone fresh in midfield, and someone fresh in defense. So try and kind of boost all of those areas a little bit for the final 10 minutes. Okay, it is a loss, I'm afraid, but it kind of gives us an idea of where the weaknesses are in our squad. So we definitely need a better goalkeeper, and that's going to be one of the priorities for January. Um, uh, I don't know what's out there at the moment. Let me just have a cheeky, cheeky little look. The thing is, we don't have perhaps the money to invest in um, in new goalkeepers, so. Uh, I don't have a package going on right now and I, I don't want to try putting one up. But yeah, so we're looking for someone a bit better than, than these guys. Um, but again, money is a constraint. Our facilities are a constraint as well. Um, once we have a package, we should be able to see some players here. But this is sort of the sort of quality we, um, we're we looking for. So if I take out... Let me just try something. So that's the quality we have right now. Um, we want someone at least marginally better. So this is the sort of players uh, we got it. we're kind of looking for if I go the other way there we go so some of these you can kind of see if I go to the cheapest possible they are already a very good players but at the moment we can't even reach any of this quality at all if I just take one down a little bit Um, so this more achievable, um, but but not all that much better than we have right now. So, yeah, something to consider to try and scout to try and find some money. Maybe um, as far as goals wise with the with the board, we're doing okay. Um, we haven't bought many under twenty threes this season. We did last season. Um, this season not not so much but uh, yeah so we'll see I'll try and make some progress and I can't guarantee that I'll come back for the uh, winter transfer window but I'll have I'll, the progress might have to be slower than that just because life is really really busy right now and I can't dedicate the time to to play all that much but we'll try to still put an episode out every week Thanks so much for sticking around and watching and hope you're enjoying the series. Give it a like and subscribe. Take care. Bye-bye.